you might step into the owner or step into whoever you're working with and say, hey, listen, I know we do all this stuff and I want to earn your business all the way around, right? But let me hyper-focus and work on your site or build you a lead gen in this one area. And if I do a good job for you and I grow your sales and I grow your business in windows or siding or gutters or whatever it is you want to tackle, then I want to earn, I want to go on and move into another area with you and make money with you, right? So I'm trying to get, I'm curious how we should approach companies similar to who I work for now that do multiple things such as siding, windows, doors, roofing, and gutters. I think that's a really good question, Joshua. Um, so I think when you start a relationship, instead of coming into the company and going, hey, I do it all, um, you know, I'm, I'm going to focus on all of these for you. I'm going to really push this through um, the roof. I would go in and say, hey, listen, I know that you make this much money on siding, right? Like we know siding is good money, whether it's stucco, whether whatever it is that you're putting up, it makes really good money for these companies. And so same thing with windows, right? So you might step into the owner or step into whoever you're working with and say, hey, listen, I know we do all this stuff and I want to earn your business all the way around, right? But let me hyper-focus and work on your site or build you a lead gen in this one area and if I do a good job for you and I grow your sales and I grow your business in windows or siding or gutters or whatever it is you want to tackle, then I want to earn, I want to go on and move into another area with you and make money with you, right? And so I would, instead of trying to get all of their business in all the areas, right? Because as you guys know, I own Pro Angle Construction um, and we focus on a lot of different stuff, windows, doors, concrete, roofing, like we do it all, right? And because we do it all, it would be a lot for one person to take on or for me to believe that they were going to take it on, especially if I didn't know search engine optimization, if I didn't know lead generation, um, I would be more likely to work with a guy like yourself, Joshua, that came in and just said, hey, um, you know, I, I know we make a lot of money with siding. I want to come in and I want to work on the siding thing um, with you. I'm going to start generating some clients. You can try them out, right? And I'd probably use the go fast, look sexy approach. Um, to where you're, you're you're building out a landing page or building out a little quick five page site that converts people um, as quickly as possible from Google ads, Facebook ads to get them in the door. And I would let my boss, who you're talking about, I would let him try those leads out. Um, maybe maybe I'd send him two to five leads, let him try it out, see what he closes. Um, he'd be happy with the results, and we'd move forward from there to where I'd start grabbing his, like you said, siding, windows, doors, roofing, and gutters. Okay. Um, so that's the way I would approach it. Go after just one, build the trust, build your character, um, and, and, and really build that relationship with them to where they, where they trust you and you'll be able to start pulling over the rest of their business, okay?